everybody, what's going on? Jerome here, and welcome back to our awesome Spore Let's Play, everybody. Thanks for joining me today. If you missed out the other episodes, I'd highly suggest going to check those out. And I was reading through the comments, and a lot of people were saying that I'm doing my city layout very poorly. Uh, apparently, there's like a way to really maximize this thing, uh, and I was just totally not doing that. People were saying, like, your factories don't work attached to other factories, and in fact, you're supposed to do it attached to houses. Uh, and that's what actually builds it up. So apparently my layout is absolutely atrocious. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna sell off pretty much uh, Maybe not sell off everything, but we're gonna sell off. So let me see like that is That's a house. So what we should be doing is putting this here as a for instance putting that there uh, And then or, or something along these lines like that Right, and that'll have or even maybe putting like like this yeah putting this here and that'll have that effect and then we can put down another house, like, right here. And now the idea is... Oh my gosh, that actually does work. Take a look at how much our spice production just went up. Alright, so it looks like we're now at 1,600. So that actually works really well. So I wonder if I could do this again. We have 5 happiness in 1,600, actually. Honestly, I'd probably just keep that. That seems like a pretty good ratio. And I could even afford more vehicles. Cool. So now, we've got some good... Yeah, we got some good armies here watching over us. And apparently orange one of your spice derricks is under attack. No, not again. We're not doing this game again. I ain't playing this game. They try to take back this spice derrick over here? Oh no, they don't. I don't know who you guys think you are. They took it. They took it, but not for long. And actually, someone was recommending to me one thing I do as well is I redo my vehicle's layout, because apparently you can yeah, you can increase their military power simply by adding more guns to it. I don't know if this is true, but we're going to give it a try. So let's modify it. I want to see if this actually does work. Um, yeah, it has 40, so 26 military power. So let's keep adding in more weapons and see what happens. So if I was to put down like a duo blaster, like that. Oh my gosh, it actually does. How many more of these can I just add? Can I just keep adding things? So like the planet sniper. Oh my gosh. We can make this thing so powerful. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. I'm so glad my comment section was telling me to do this. This is insane. I mean, the thing looks absolutely absurdly ridiculous, but I don't really care considering how much more damage it's going to do. Oh. <laughs> 40 military power. Let's see how this thing does now against them. Okay, friends. Let's have a little bit of fun. Over here. Oh my god! Instantly vaporized! This is wonderful! Let's go take that city I've wanted for so long! And a lot of people have been telling me- Oh, they're unhappy? Well, they're about to get a lot on more unhappy. And a lot of people were telling me that I should try and make friends with people instead of just only making enemies. I kind of like the idea of only making enemies, though. So I'm probably gonna do that. <laughs> I want to destroy everybody. Oh my god, look at that epic. It's just, it just killed that entire creature stage. Like, they're like the, they're not even the tribal stage yet, and they're all just gone. Oh, that's right. Maybe I should take over these guys first, because they are inherently the weakest. I'm actually, I actually think this might be the move to make. See what their, their city defenses are pretty weak. Hey, and there's our epic Baka. Wait a minute. Who do you think you are? Dang it, they took another one of my spice derricks. Come on, guys, move out faster. Let's go. And, oh, yep, yeah, they are so dead. They both just, oh my god. I love our new tank, how powerful they are. I love how powerful our new tanks are. Thank you. Give us this spice, Derek, back, please. And we have $10,000 now, jeez. One of your spice, Derek's is under attacks. Okay, well, you know what? No one asked your opinion about this. And now we're going to go and conquer an entire city. So let's go and attack that turret there. Perfect. I feel so bad. These guys are our friend. And we're just going, all right, time to die, friend. It's nothing personal. We just need another city to collect more houses so we can build more troops. Oh my gosh, no. Jeez, those turrets are so deadly. Wow, these guys are extremely powerful. Those turrets, come on. I have a bad feeling this is a very militaristic... Uh, Civilization here, and that's why they're doing so much damage to us. All right, capture city. Come on. No, no. Can't they just attack the center of the city? 
Because I keep attacking, like, the entertainment places. Alright, there we go. Specifically attack the city center. You don't need to destroy all their houses. I mean, it's kind of funny if you do, but you don't have to. Oh, jeez. Well, these guys are so doomed. I think we finally conquered someone. In the meantime, wow, we're at 3,200 production at the moment? That's awesome. That's really good. We're gonna have so much more money. We can't get any more tanks. Apparently, we didn't lose any in this onslaught. I could have sworn we were about to lose them, but apparently, we just did not. Okay. Come on. Can I offer them to surrender? Let's see. We have little say to you. Make your point. Oh, I wanted to... I honestly wanted to try and just offer you an out instead of having me destroy everything you've ever loved, but if that's how it's got to be, then that's how it's got to be. Thank you, and give me your city. We conquered someone! There we go. All right. Oh, what's this little cutscene here? Yeah, do a little dance. Beautiful. And that is how you captured a city. It will remain a military city. Yes. Oh my gosh. And I can get more housing now. Oh, it's game time. Okay. So what do they have for us? Like two entertainment things. All right, let's put one house here. What are you? Are you supposed to be a house? Maybe those were houses. All right, let's sell that for zero dollars. Whatever. Put a factory right here. Uh, actually, I'll put a factory there. And let's put a house right here. Let's get rid of that. And we'll put we'll put an entertainment place right there so that they're not completely miserable. And I'll put another factory right here. There you go. See? Good as new. 1600, they're not happy, they're not sad, they just kind of exist. And now it's time to take over a city. Do you have any turrets? They have no turrets for defense. They just have ships. They are so going down. Baka City celebrating have an increased income. That's good. Wait a minute. There's some people down here trying to fight us. All right. Well, if that's what you want to do, you're dumb because you are about to get de destroyed completely. There you go. Have fun. There we go. Oh, wait. Someone's trying to communicate with us. The planet trembles for our mighty armada. You will not survive. Prepare for war. I'm sorry. Did you say something? <laughs> that's awesome. So apparently yellow hates us. You're no longer at war with the yellow nation because we stood up to them. They don't want to go to war with us anymore. That's hilarious. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, you're just dead. Instantly deaded. Let's go. Where do these guys think they're even going? Come on. You're not escaping from my clutches just yet. Oh, these guys are so dead. Only one of them survived. Literally only one survived that. Is one of my cities under attack? Your city's under attack. Okay. Uh, so they were going to attack me. Really? That was all they could do? Well, here you go. Here's that. Here's that. And you know what? I'll build two little tanks to make you miserable. Thank you. And now you're dead. Without a doubt. All right. Take out that turret. Come on, guys. Oh, my gosh. With all that concentrated fire. Take out these ones. We could use your help. Would you declare war on Yellow Nation? Um. Uh. Let's see. Absolutely. Yay! We made good friends. We're allied with Red Nation now. Nice! We made an ally because of war. Isn't that awesome, guys? Okay, keep it up. Keep it up, military. Come on. Don't let up the pressure this time. This is an all-or-nothing deal we're going for here. And I think these guys are much closer, so we are going to... There we go. Oh my gosh. That is a ridiculously strong military. We need that turret down. Alright. The new armada is here. There we go. That, they are going to die. They are so going down after this. I'm very excited about this. Yes, keep firing at them along the way. These guys are going to go bankrupt just because they, literally, they just keep flying by and just keep getting destroyed instantly. Guys, this is ridiculous. Man, I love my comment section right now. 
for recommending me to just make this army the way I did. Okay, and there's a turret in the back here. That turret's gotta go. And I think we can honestly make even more. I think we're able to make as many as we... Yeah, we can make more. One, well, one more. There we go. I wish there was a hotkey for producing them. I'm sure there actually is, to be honest, but I'm just not familiar with it. Okay, come on. And we're only at $3,200 left because we spent so much money on war. We might need to lay off the war after this city for a little bit. Or take more spice derricks. That too. Oh, come on, guys. It's not that hard to divide yourselves up properly so you can actually fight. Oh my gosh, look at that. And that was a waste of a tank for them. And time to take out this one here. Yep. And prepare for your city to crumble. Perfect. As long as they don't have anyone defending them. Honestly, I should just focus entirely on this. Look at that. Yes! The city will collapse. This is the one. Keep it up. Keep it up, guys. And my cities all have such good turret defense. I don't even need to keep any tanks for defense anymore. So even if they start coming at me, they're just doomed. All right. Keep it up. Red Nation's growing fast. I'm glad that we're friends with Red Nation, because that gives us a lot of time to really make things good. Yellow Nation, or Orange Nation hates us, and Yellow Nation's just hard to please. Uh, well, oh well. You fought our enemy. So ah, That's why we got so much, because we fought one of their enemies. I didn't even know we were doing that, but good to know. Come on, capture this city already. Oh my gosh. They keep trying to spawn them, and they keep dying. They're going to run out of money so quick. Come on. Capture this city here. I might be able to control the entire continent soon. Alright. Got them out of here. Keep it up, guys. Keep it up. Another one bites it. And come on. Get me this city already. I'm so proud of us. I'm so proud of how far we've come in this civilization stage. Well, one continent's good. But we need to take over the entire world. So I think we go for this continent next. Or we go for Red's home continent. Because Red's going to be a huge threat. We've never made contact with Blue, so I don't know if they hate us or like us. It says they're happy with us, so that's good, even though they haven't talked to us yet. So I guess it could go either way. And perfect! And that's what I'm talking about. So another city is officially ours for the taking. And that is not a bad position to be in. Oh, man. That looks perfect. Uh, you've captured this religious city by military means. If you keep this specialty, you should target cities with low happiness in order to convert their citizens. Choose city specialty. Military. Always military. Thank you. Let's sell this and sell that. Destroyed building. We'll put a house. Well, I guess what we could do is we could put a house here. And then if I was to put a factory here off of it. I get 800, and then if I put a house here, a house there would do better, I guess, but not really too much. I could put a house there, and what would a, would a factory, no, no, all right, well, maybe if we put that there and that there, that would be much smarter. Now we can put, like, one little entertainment thing here, and look at that. Now they get $2,000 a minute, and they're pretending to be happy. Isn't life great? All right, so let's put one turret here and one turret here for the city's defense. And let's get some more of that. Is someone trying to contact me? Ah, Yellow Nation again. Lol. Oh, my gosh. I literally ran out of money. I can't even buy more tanks, but look at all the tanks we're able to get. Wow, and I think that's going to be a good place to call this episode quits. So thank you so much, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you didn't remember to smash that like button, I'll see you next time with some more awesome spore. Have a good one, everyone.